Hey everyone, today I'm going to be doing a Loot Crate unboxing. This is actually the Mystery Crate, so I have no idea what it is, if there's a theme to it. Loot Crate is a monthly subscription box that is geared towards kind of nerds and geeky kind of things. And they describe it as like Comic-Con in a box. And I just subscribed this month because the theme was cyber and they mentioned in the email that some of the items might be Borderlands um, themed and that's what this is. This is the vault symbol sign and I actually made the shirt myself. So let's get to the mystery crate. And they have different themes every month and I like that they tell you what the theme is so if you like last last month it was fantasy or was it fantasy? No. It was Unite. Yeah it was Unite but there was one month that said fantasy and it was like Dungeons and Dragons and Game of Thrones and all that stuff, which I'm not a, a fan of either of those. So you can kind of pick and choose which months you want and which ones you don't. If you want to do the whole 365, it's up to you. The perfect unboxing. No, this is probably not going to be the perfect unboxing because every time I try to do an unboxing, it just goes horribly wrong for me. <laughs> First little thing is... I have no idea. It's a Loot Crate exclusive though. 50 analog. Tindo. Now it looks like an old school Nintendo um, thing. And it's Doctor Who themed but looks kind of like Doctor Mario or something. And what the hell is this thing? <laughs> there you go. That's what that was. And then a little blind box of a Transformer Series 1. And I got Optimus Prime. So that's exciting. He's the main one. I know because I've seen the Transformer movies. Only watched the first one. The second two aren't good. I, or I think there's five now. Don't even watch those if I don't didn't even mention those. The first one's pretty good though. And there's a little information sheet that I can't freaking read right now. Next up is a Street Fighter headband. I've never actually played Street Fighter, Mortal Kombat, or any of those kind of, kind of games. Actually, I think I probably have. So this is going to come in handy. I'm going to probably put it on my cat. That'll be the thumbnail for this video is old Street Fighter Nico. That's going to be cute. The next item is a hex bug and it is also Transformers themed and is Bumblebee, which is very fitting for a, a bug thing. And this either seems like my cat would attack it or be scared of it. They actually make these for cats. And a Simpsons wallet. Truth, truth be told, I'm not really a fan of the Simpsons. But I've seen these wallets before and they're kind of nifty because they're made out of like this indestructible kind of material that's made from recycled recycled things. I can't talk today. I got cold. So that's fun. So there's that funness. I don't know anybody that does like The Simpsons that I could get this to because I'm not going to use it. Necessary Evil Super Villains of DC Comics. I'm guessing this is a CD of sorts. Is it a game? Got Catwoman on it. I shouldn't question it now stickers. I know at one point there were some Markiplier stickers in one of them. Oh. There are stickers for um, Major League Gaming teams. I didn't know they had teams. And this it's some kind of money. But I know it's not real. I got 500 somethings. Anybody know what this is? Because I don't. And 
and then a full game download and a digital comic loot <laughs> mess it into the box. Now some of the loot crate boxes are actually themed with whatever the um, theme of the month is. So know that the covert one it folded out to kind of look like a laptop, like a supplies laptop. Some pretty interesting things in here. Not all of them are quite my fandom. Some of them confused me. But hopefully the cyber out know a little bit more about it, at least the Borderlands themed things in there. If you have anything to say about Loot Crate or anything I got down below, just let me know and I'll see you next time. Bye.